Hey loves, I'm back once again with your divine message. Moving on to my air signs, beginning with Aquarius. I've laid out the cards, so here are y'all's messages for this evening. Starting out with Judgment. Four of Hearts. The Five of Spades. The Devil. The Ten of Clubs. The King of Hearts. The Hierophant. The Sun. The Hangman. And finally we have the Three of Spades. All right, my Aquarians. Pull up a chair because the tea is hot tonight. Spirit is saying that you've had a wake-up call. You found something out about someone close to you, either a friend or a um, family member, you know, either personal or professional. Um, they're not who they say they are. Um, and you finally see right through this person. They're only with you because they want something. You know, they want to try to get enough information about you to use against you later or um, whatever the case may be. But just know that this person that everybody's been warning you about, you're finally seeing them for what they really are. And this is something like you've gathered enough information from a lot of people or they're wanting to be around you because they're trying to get enough information from you to use it against you later. So be very careful. If you're if this person's still in your life right now, be very careful with them. Um, and if you've decided that, you know, to let them go, it's good for you either way. You need to focus on yourself. With the King of Hearts, emotional control, you need to um, focus on yourself and just realign all your chakras, you know, whatever you need to do to get in the right frame of mind. Because this person really knew how to manipulate you, manipulate the situation to get you to feel sorry for them. You need to go back to your old way of doing things, you know, start from scratch all over again. Um, yes, this person hurt you. Finding out this information hurt you, but it's better that you know now so that you can process the information and learn from this mistake and then try not to repeat it again. You know, being very cautious about who you let in your life later on. Um, Spirit is also saying, you know, don't worry about this too much because there is a light at the end of that tunnel. Uh, because what's coming for you is very positive. What's coming in your direction. Uh, maybe this had to happen because you needed to see this person for who they really were. Um, you know, they were just pretending to be something that you wanted them to be. You didn't want to see what was right in front of you. You know, even though people kept telling you, like, you know, be careful, um, tread lightly around this person. You know, you want you want to see the good in people, but there was no use in this situation. I mean, and it had to come out sometime that this person was only hanging around you because they were taking advantage of you and everything that you're telling them, they're turning around and telling other people. Um, but for you yourself, working on yourself is the best thing that you can do right now. Um, cutting this person off completely is the best choice that you can make. If it's someone in your family, then it's kind of difficult because you may need to distance yourself for a while. And maybe later on, you can decide to kind of, you know, reassess the situation and then try to work it out. Um, but for right now, just focus on you. Focus on, uh, you know, um, tell, ask the spirit to illuminate your path. You've waited long enough already for this moment, and um, you've invested too much time in a person that wasn't even worth worth your time to begin with. Um, so the end all here would be letting them go or letting the whole situation go and starting over again, starting a new chapter. 
If you still want to continue to associate with this person, that's completely up to you. But just know that this person moving forward cannot be trusted. So be very careful. Like I said, tread lightly when dealing with this person. Because the only reason why they want to be around you is because they want to see what they can get out of you. See if there's a way for them to take advantage of you. And then when your defenses are down, it's like, oh, well, you know, it's one of those situations like you're on your own. You know, but for the most part, for you, everything looks good except for that one, you know, roadblock. And once you've already decided to cut this person loose or to kind of associate with them very little or not as much, then um, everything will start getting better for you. And those are my messages for Aquarius. If you like this video, go ahead and cl click the like button. Let me know in the comments how this resonates with you. Take what resonates, what doesn't, leave it be. It could resonate with someone else. And as always, I want to thank you again for being here with me tonight. I love each and every one of you. May God bless you all and keep you safe. And I will see you on the next video. Bye.